think Jaguar's announcement that they're entering Formula E is huge news for both race fans and for fans of the brand Jaguar because they have a huge history in motorsport, like at Le Mans, with multiple race wins. And I think the, the whole industry has changed so much in just a few short years. The fact that a brand like Jaguar that has the heritage is actually looking forward at the new technologies that a championship like Formula E has to offer is, is just going to be great for everybody. The Formula E Championship, when it, when it was first muted, I think people were a little bit confused and concerned about what it was going to mean. But the championship has just proven that it is based on a really solid ground of technological innovation. And it has excited everybody um, from manufacturers to race fans. And the thing that excites me most about it is that it's actually appealing to the next generation of end user, of consumer, of engineer, of driver. It's actually appealing to the younger people because it takes place in city centres, which makes it unique. It's so much more accessible and user-friendly, unlike many of the traditional types of motorsport. Again, because it takes place in city centres, but also because of the way it's harnessed all of its social media. I think the championship is really shaking things up a bit um, with the traditionalists and, well, certainly catching a lot of people off guard. Well, I think in recent years, Jaguar have proven that they are really taking huge steps forward and the thing with the Formula E championship is it's all about technology. Now Jaguar have been leading the way in recent years with, with their aluminium cars and, and a lot of lightweight um, composites. The fact that they're now moving into the sort of technological side of things with a championship like Formula E shows that well they're, they're looking very much to the future. I think the thing with Jaguar fans is that they are a loyal, loyal group of people. I remember somebody once saying to me that you know you, you really do have Jaguar running through your blood. And I think the fact that Jaguar have come back to racing, it, ultimately it is a performance brand and really it's where a performance brand belongs, performing and showing that on the track. I think the fact that Jaguar have decided to enter the season, coming in at any point um, into a championship is always going to be tricky. It doesn't matter if you're coming in in the beginning when all the technology is unproven or if you're coming in in season three. but. Jaguar investing heavily in this and, and in the technology and partnering with Williams Advanced Engineering, who they already have a very close working relationship with. Um, I think the prospects are going to be very good and very exciting and I just hope that it bodes well for the future of the whole motor industry and the technology and the lessons learned can be spread across the industry as a whole. Well, there's no doubt that motorsport is where big developments are made because in a competition environment people are always having to think out of the box and really challenge conventional ideas. So the fact that there is a championship like this which really pushes the boundaries and really has accelerated the technological advances made in the entire electric powertrain from the start to the finish can only bode well. I see this moving into road cars and the industry as a whole quicker than I think most people feel that maybe it would have done had a championship like this not been on the cards.